don't want to be like the people of Medina. Allah had given them a chance. They had the ultimate wali. But the wali only wins when you and I, who are the followers, have two conditions. One of them is iman and one of them is sabr. Sabr, when we say it, brothers and sisters, it's very different to the traditional sense of sitting and taking it, suffering through it. The true meaning of sabr, brothers and sisters, what the Quran teaches us is that sabr means resistance. So what happened to the people of Medina? And why are you and I asking this question? Because God, before he sent Imam Hussein to do his mission, which would have liberated the globe, he sent Muslim. Muslim was the test. You and I were at a stage where mankind is very ready for the coming of the Mahdi. But Allah tested us with another wali. Will we pass the test of our wali so that we can pass this test and go to where we need to go? Remember the words of Shaheed Qasim Sulaimani. You will be asked about the wali al faqih We know how it goes. The people failed Muslim, and after they failed Muslim, then we saw the slaughter of Imam Hussein. So what happened to the people of Medina? What was their problem? The people of Medina were a lot like you and I, actually. They were good people. They prayed. They fasted, they were devoted to Rasulullah. They were very good with the wajibat. You'd be surprised, the people of Medina, it's mentioned in history. Our Prophet Muhammad wasallam would make wudu. When he would make wudu, the mu'mineen would gather and they wouldn't allow the drops of wudu to fall from the hands of Rasulullah to the ground. But what was the problem then? Wajibat were there, alhamdulillah. Doing their job, good people. You see, the problem of the people of Medina was they would pick and choose with Islam. There were certain parts of Islam that they really liked, that they would do. But then there were other parts of Islam that were difficult, that went against their interests. And there, those mu'mineen failed. Picking and choosing. Islam is not a buffet. If you want to be one of the Shia, you've got to do what the Ahlul Bayt say. We don't believe that Imam Hussein died so I could live the life of Yazid. Sabr means resistance. You will be asked about the Wali al faqih People failed Muslim, and after they failed Muslim, then we saw the slaughter of Imam Hussein. You will be asked about the Wali al